Okay, so we're going to go ahead and place the sensor. So remember, the side of the film here, I'll take this tab off so you can see, has the manufacturer's name on it and it's the flat side. So this flat side here, we'll stick our bite block on there, right in the center. And we're going to place this in the mouth. When we're placing it, that white flat side must go towards the PID. So when it's in the mouth, remember, cords coming out of the mouth and the sensor is going to be facing in this direction. When we go to place it, we're gonna open up Dexter or you would have your patient open. You'll come in sideways and then rotate the sensor into place. If you try to go straight in, it's hard for some patients because they have to open pretty wide. So we're gonna go in flat, rotate into that molar position, ensuring the sensor is behind that last molar. Have our patient close and we want to make sure that our sensor and the end of the PID are both parallel so that we're able to open up those contacts and get a diagnostic image. So using the outer corner of the eye, it's kind of my landmark. I'll come down, cover up the sensor. You want to make sure the circle completely covers up the sensor so you don't end up with cone cuts. So that looks pretty good. The end of or my sensor, the end of my pit are both parallel. So I'll go out and push the exposure button and then our image will populate on the screen.